Did I now check the level? Enjoying the state of the deck. The main lengths of railing are done, so we can really spend time out here enjoying it. That beeping you're hearing is Jacob Hart at work in the skid steer, um, which we'll tell you about in a minute. So, the day that I picked up Jacob, we went straight from the airport in Portland to get our five little lambs. So, we have a total of 10 sheep now. Nine females and one male. While I've been busy working with Jacob, Tina and the kids have seen them more than me. But it was a really nice family we bought them from, from and um, we're really excited about those little sheep. Any updates with the sheep? They all look good. And they're yeah. finally blending with the older yeah. sheep that we had already got. Yeah, the original group of five and the new group of five sometimes were together, sometimes apart. Sorry, baby woke up from a nap and is feeling pretty fussy. Uh, we did some digging out of stumps with what's called a stump planer. I've got an auger drive for digging holes with the um, with the skid steer, and I got a bit that's made to dig into stumps, and it worked pretty good. Uh, our friend, that's a professional tree cutter, came by and showed me and Jake some tricks and cut down a few trees. And that was really fun, just to see someone who's a lot better than you at something you've done. You know, you really notice, like, okay, this guy knows what he's doing. Uh, we moved the junky RV. It is not gone, because it's really hard to get rid of an RV. Um, I think I, I'm having trouble finding places that you can even pay to take it to a salvage yard. So I don't know. Well, I'll need help figuring out. If you have any ideas, let me know. Because all the the ideas of give it away for free aren't working out very well. But I'll keep trying. And we're prepping an area. We got the RV out of there because we're prepping that spot to build an equipment shed. We re we need a really nice structure to park the skid steer, the tractor, implements, that kind of stuff. It needs to be protected from the weather. So we're working on that. And that's what Jacob's out there actively working on now. I'm going to be stuck in a work meeting for a little bit here in a second, and then I'll get out there and help them. And that's the state of things. The kids are on summer break and just living it up. And Jacob's here for a little over a week still, so we can get a lot more done. And yeah, that's the state of things. We'll, um, we're just so excited to enjoy this deck. It really doubles the usable space of the yurt. Yay! 
If you can remember, in the early days, in the summer, we would um, we would set up this big blue tent to eat dinner in when it's when it's hot on summer evenings in the yurt. But the deck is going to be the replacement for that. So, oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. That's it, guys. See you bye. next time. Bye. 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 So I can take. Mm -hmm. You trying to kick his phone? No kicking. Yum 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 yum. Ivy. Yummy. Yummy. Mmm. Yummy. Mm. How you doing, James? What are you eating rapid fire over there? Taters? Uh-huh. Jacob's eating some steaks and taters. Mm -hmm. Aria ate something. There's not much left of it. <laughs> <laughs>